the court notified me that my final decree of divorce has been approved by the judge. I know that it sucks being alone. I come home and I'm alone. I go everywhere alone. I don't care how long you've been with her. If she still has to depend on other people to make sure her bills are paid, she's not your woman. And she still deserves to talk to as many men as she chooses to until she can find the right provider. I don't care if you have children with her. I don't I don't care if you believe you're married to her. Okay, so I just got into my car after going on a date, right? And let me just tell you something. I don't know what the deal is with like men now, but I had told him prior that I will be having pre and post date expenses and is that okay and are you going to cover them and I don't know if he wasn't listening or like what the deal was or whatever but he when I handed him the white envelope he looked shocked Hey, we got, we got a fool in his house again. Full house, no Mary Kate. Hey, 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 there he go right there. My man, I'm all home with the building. Hey, you. Hey. And honey dip tea. Honey dip tea. Every <laughs> white man's dream. Oh, <laughs> back to the white boys. <laughs> yeah, because you know what I mean? She she don't be treating the Mexicans right. What? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't even, don't Shout even do Shout out to our that. Mexican <laughs> brothers. She gives, she gives them no play. Yeah, she don't give them no play, dog. It's just There's a lot of people I don't get no play, but, oh. you know, that's a whole other conversation. Oh, my God. <laughs> that's the first topic. <laughs> <laughs> just your pocket. <laughs> yeah, that. Haters. Look, I got a, a plug. I got to go back to the old guess who's been that? Still smelling crack in my clothes. Don't. Don't let Plog relapse on them hoes. Don't let him relapse, <laughs> man. You, you, you know, you usually let me kick the show off if I'm on it. Oh, wait a minute, dog. Hold on, dog. Uh -oh. Let me tell you, go ahead, kick Maybe it off. Maybe you feel some kind of way. What kind of buttons you got what, over what, there? What you need, bro? What, what you need, bro? You got a... I got some crickets. I got some bullshit alert, dog. Good morning. You know what I'm saying? I got some Halloween. Oh, yeah. Lord. Some purge. Oh, okay. Okay. What you need? Hit, hit me with the purge. Hit first. you with the purge. Now then hit me with the well, hit, after I, after I get into it. Hit me with the peanut. Uh, yeah. Huh? And then we'll clear it up with some claps at the end. Okay. Uh, all right, all right, okay. You ready, Ron? Right, let me see. Let me see. How, how we going? How we going to do that? Uh, we about to get heavy. Are uh, uh, you ready, Ron? Yeah. All right. Go ahead. Hit the purge first. Yeah. We'll let that rock for a second. Yeah. Plug her oh, in the building. <laughs> okay. <laughs> about to get nasty. Feel like I'm coming out to a football game. Right, you you getting heavy. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, women and children of all ages, all over the age of 18, welcome to the Disjoint. It's Disjoint Podcast. Oh. Ah, there you go. Yeah. Wait, just like that. <laughs> <laughs> there it is, right there, boy. Send him back with the king. Go on, we done kept it going. I've yeah. been in this yeah, show. Yeah, yeah, I a special it. guest, Mr. Oh. L. Plaga. Oh, yeah, no. if you're looking for the for the right of me, you're looking at the the beautiful, wonderful, sensational. Yes. See? See? Honey you dip tea. Honey, honey dip tea. Dip <laughs> like, you listen enough tea. to know what the name is. Yeah. See? <laughs> All the way over there on the far left, we got my man over there, Mr. CJ. Listen, man, I, I, I'm liking this intro. Mr. CJ, you gotta say, you gotta give a little respect, Mr. CJ. Listen, man, like, hey, no, shout out to Lowe's for his introduction, all, but I, this one feels a little, a little different, a little different, you know. And now, last but not least, you know what I mean? Never forgotten, everybody already know. If you don't know, once in a while, you gotta take it back, and it's Guess who's bizarre? Still smelling crack of the clothes. No back or read left with these hoes. Mr. Lose the Dark Gable. Oh, 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 plug on the building. <laughs> oh, gosh. <laughs> oh, man. Listen, y'all make sure y'all sit back. We got a great show for y'all tonight. Like, comment, subscribe. That's right, man. Sit your $5 ass down before we make change. Five videos to react to. We're going to have some laughs. We're going to have some fun. Ah. Let me make sure I get this started because as T would say, what is it? Why is it not? No, why? what is it? What is it? Stay ready. Get ready. Here. Yes. Uh, uh, that's Don't look at me like that. I was about to say, I had used that when I went to the massage parlor last mm -hmm. week. <laughs> and, and then what happened? 
<laughs> I got ready. Because <laughs> I stay ready. Stay <laughs> <laughs> ready, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so it yeah. seems ready. like you're learning from me. Very good. Yeah, exactly. Very good. Yeah. Very good. In all she, different facets. <laughs> <laughs> so she was like, are you ready? I said, listen here, baby, I stay ready. <laughs> so I don't have to get finally, ready. He finally catching on. He finally catching on. He said, you want me to start from the back? I said, no, you start from the front. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> wow. gotta be careful. That's usually when they bring the dudes in on you. <laughs> yeah, I ain't doing nothing. I'm like, oh, baby, your hands got kind of muscular. <laughs> oh, man, let's get to the very first video, y'all. So, for the very first video, we got we got a woman that says she blocked men that doesn't pass her test. Oh, God. Damn. You like that, Ty? We got to see what the test is first, right. man. Probably some BS. <laughs> It's Fish Jump Podcast. Oh. Uh, let's go. One of the fastest way that I block men and I test men is I tell them I'm at the nail salon. And if they ask me what color I'm getting, cool, cool, cool. If they don't say how much is it or what's your cash app or what's your Zelle so I can cover the cost, you're blocked. You're blocked. Because at that point, you're a taker. And men like that, they love to say, okay, text me a picture of your nails when you get it done. Sorry, Buki, you're already added to the block list by saying that. You, as a man, are supposed to be a provider, meaning that you provide. Why are you asking me to send me a picture of the nails then? If I don't pay for it, how am I going to send you a picture? Block those men. That don't make any sense. <laughs> like I said. Yeah, hold on. <laughs> like I said, some BS. Of course. You know what it is. Hold on. You know what? Let's go to the comment. Let's go to the comment. And then we're going to go to our reaction. Mm -hmm. So the first comment <laughs> says, maybe we should do that during our oil change. Right. <laughs> Give it up to the boy. <laughs> Give it up to the boy. <laughs> Give it up to the boy. <laughs> you know what I mean? Can you imagine? Can you imagine? What you doing? Shit, I'm at Jiffy, baby. Um, I'm at Jiffy, baby. Rob is calling see what you're doing. Bitch, I'm at Jiffy, baby. <laughs> 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 Look, you can be doing anything in Jiffy. Like, come on, you can. Nah. Hey, listen. Yeah, you man. Know oh. You say you're a picture of that oil you change. <laughs> yeah. right. She like, uh, where you at? I'm in the zone. <laughs> oh, what zone? Auto zone. <laughs> like, yeah, yeah, I'm in here. Yeah, I, mean. I, I got stuff to do. All right. Second comment. All the good guys are single for a damn good reason. Yep. Is that how it is modern dating, man? That's why they. That's why I'm they curious. just paying the. Is that 40. how it is modern dating? That's why they just paying the forty and just getting it over with. Because this is high level. This is high level prostitution. Low, it's low level prostitution. That's no, yeah, low level. That's low level. all it is. It's all it is. All right. So the very last comment. Very soon it's going to come down to if he isn't buying you a house. On the first date, oh Lord, then he's broken, not worth your time. <laughs> 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 we, is your house built to the side of a mountain? Oh, I'm sorry, uh, you're not on my level. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So go on. Who want to kick this off first? Plot. Uh, what you gotta say, dog? Listen, I'm gonna be honest with you. More power to her, man. I ain't mad. If it, first of all, you ain't mad. No. For what? If, if she can, if if she can get it, get it. If she can get it, get it. If you gonna give it to her, that's on you. Say, can she get it from you? <laughs> can she get it from me? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> I, I might have blocked her before she blocked me. <laughs> she she, me she might. Why you ain't never respond back? What's going on here? <laughs> I'm gonna tell you what's going on. I, I forgot about you. <laughs> I figured, I figured, you, you go, I figured you going to unblock her. I figured you just only forgot about it. A couple hours or something. You said you're in the nail salon, right? Why, why, why would I call you back? <laughs> I thought you were busy, so. I may be honest with you. I never cared if your nail salon was done. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, go ahead, T. As a female, that's my expense. Like, perfect example. Yeah. I went to the nail salon today. I go every two, three weeks. Nails, feet, pedicure, all that. That is my expense. That is my way in beautifying or let's just say pampering myself. Why mm -hmm. should a man have to pay for my beautifying expenses? If that's the case, like women, are y'all paying for their haircuts? Shit. I, hey, no, I have never known a woman pay for my haircuts. Haircut. So 50, at the end of the too. day, if somebody's texting me and I'm at the nail salon, me being at the nail salon has nothing to do with whatever expenses there that that it that comes from it. Yeah. So me blocking you because you're not paying for my nails is just stupid and immature. But let me, let me ask you, if a, if a man did pay for your nails, how does that make you feel? I've never asked and nobody ever just volunteered. 
Right. Nobody just Would that make you feel less no, of a woman? At the end of the day, saying, I'm you know not, what I mean? If a dude's just not, like, you know what? Let me go ahead and pay for them. Yeah, but see, I ain't like huh? I ain't that close with nobody for them for nobody even think that they can do that because I don't want you to start thinking, okay, you is more than what it is. Yeah. Mm. Uh, you know, I don't know. If 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 I'm ever getting it, I mean I'm bald as a motherfucking eagle, but <laughs> if I'm <laughs> when I had hair, if I, if a woman ever takes me I'm well, I'll pay for your haircut. I'm like, oh shit, she about to get it done. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna give it to you long. Like, you know, like, I didn't think I was eating ass today, but uh, <laughs> put, shit, that, uh, <laughs> put the stress on me. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that big toe in your mouth. Right. Yeah, yeah, I mean, <laughs> like, I'm sucking for me. <laughs> All right, Broski, what you gotta say? Huh? Why? Why? Why does that even make sense to you? Why do you even think that you're worth that? I don't know you. I don't know you. Now, maybe as we get down the road and are cool, but if I'm just getting to know, like, girl, and again, it's not even about the money. It's the principle. Like, what? why do you do Because at the end of the day, men that? have expenses too. So, okay, if I'm getting my hair done, I'm getting my nails done and all this other stuff, and y'all can y'all get your whatever clothes, sneakers, haircut, and all that other stuff. So, at what point do I start to consider your expenses? Why is it always just about the female expenses? And, and, it's just not. And for me, it's like it's just a, if we're it just dating, seems selfish. If we're dating and I'm treating you, like, in what way do you feel that I'm special that you treat me? And I'm not saying that monetarily; it even has to match. Like, are yeah. you are you in Target? Because that's where women spend most of their days. If you are, while you in Target, you say, "Oh, you know what? Let me. Oh, these boxes look nice. I'm gonna just pick them up." No, y'all not doing that. Y'all just sitting around waiting for us to pay for this right. and pay for that and pay for this. And it's like, where's, it's just the, like no reciprocation. where's the thought for me? No reciprocation yeah, it's, at all. It's whack. Everything is just like a one-way street. And I can't deal with nobody. It's just like a one-way street. Two-way. Two, but you know two what? of us. But you know what? That's been going on for years. That's but been going on. Again, but I, the way, but the way that but I now, think is different. So. Yeah, but see, nowadays everything is on the internet. Because I remember when I was a young boy, girls would try to get me for money. Oh, well, I'm at this. I was like, oh, word? Oh, call me when you get out of there. <laughs> but guess who? That's, that's and, an old school move. Right and, and that's an old yeah, school move. You know and I never I'm answer the, the phone back. I'm the type. Okay, if I'm in the store. Oh, you know what? I'm in the store. You need something from in here? So it's different for me. I, I'm the opposite. So yeah, I'm not, I'm not. oh, yeah, can you get me? No. I'm like, okay, well, you know what? I, I think the last time I was at your house, I noticed that you was running low. Do you need me to grab you something from here while I'm here? Okay. Where? Oh, I'm like, oh, she wanted a long story. Oh, <laughs> shit. <laughs> <laughs> those are, those are Signs you want. Those are the ones you, you want can't get rid of. Yeah. You want the daddy <laughs> alone. I know that your toothpaste is low. What the fuck? <laughs> yeah. My toothpaste is low. Yeah. How did you know? <laughs> First of exactly. all, exactly. Don't show me you care like that. Don't do that. Don't, oh, don't do that. That's don't, too much for you. That, yeah. Don't don't be like you was on low on toilet paper. I noticed your coffee was. Don't don't don't. Don't do that. <laughs> don't, don't, <laughs> Right, man. Girl, that get me a wet. Come on, man. <laughs> wow. Lord, have like, mercy. Hey, I'm from the hood. Don't be trying to show, kind, show, show me no love. What kind of private love. part you got? Because you're talking about long and strong, but Whoa. I mean, that ain't what long and strong do. That's what you listen, know the, okay, what you call listen, the split tacos do. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. I thought that's what the split tacos let me, do. Listen, let me, let, me, let me tell you Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. Men, Men can get excited. And, and, and have a little get, dribble. Get, have a little dribble that. and they draw. Oh, my God. You know what I'm <laughs> This joint podcast, y'all. Make sure you drop a like, drop a comment. Like, comment, subscribe. Tell us what subscribe. you think about that woman blocking men who don't pass her test. God damn. Jesus. <laughs> Yo, shall we slide to the next video? That's good. Oh, let me make sure I got my sip of my. Yeah, yeah. Oh, Lord. Yeah, my, my woofer right here. That's big dog. I'm telling yeah, you. Yeah, it's the it's big Ooh. boy shit right here. Enough to put a chest. Anywho, number two. Number what? Ain't that up? Num- yeah, no, what? it is not number what? Number what? Whatever. We be on that now. Oh, you already know I know how to say the words in Spanish. Then say oh. it. Number two. That's English. <laughs> <laughs> you what? say it, CJ. Hey, I know the words. Oh, man. Number two. Number two. Let me make sure I got it set up. Shut your oh, mouth. Lord. Shut your <laughs> mouth. <laughs> All go. right, video number two. We got an ex-wife that's pissed at her ex-husband <laughs> for moving on quickly after she filed for a divorce. Uh, Just like a heifer G. <laughs> <laughs> Why she got to be a heifer? You know, let me speak. Yeah, yeah, we're going to yeah, let I can't hear it's you because Peanut's so talking. Whatever. <laughs> oh. Let's go. The court notified me that... My final decree of divorce has been approved by the judge. I know that it sucks being alone. I come home and I'm alone. I go everywhere alone. 
I don't hardly talk to him anymore. <laughs> I don't blame him. I filed for the divorce. So I'm sure people are wondering, well, you filed. Why are you so upset? Why are you crying? Just because you make a decision that you think is going to end up making things better doesn't mean that you have to give up the fact that you love that person or that you did it because you were trying or whatever. I've never met anybody like him and I've never loved anybody like him either, but I don't want a divorce. I still am very much in love with my husband. See why she uh, has moved on. She didn't want a divorce, but then she asked for a divorce. <laughs> but now she don't want a yeah, divorce. Yeah, but now she don't want a divorce. <laughs> you confused. You Fucking confused. Have a G's. Rick have James a said it a long time ago. <laughs> Cocaine is a hell of a drug. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what y'all be Damn. Yeah, so, so, let's go to the first comment. And then I'm going to come back. Because I, I want you to kick this one off. So, the first comment says, My ex is living in her best friend's garage. <laughs> the same best friend that helped convince her she could do better. That's how women That's do. what the fuck she get. That's what women do. That's how Listen to these friends, me. man. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Listen to these made it. That's how red friend to me. <laughs> so, the second comment. Women do this all the time. My ex filed for divorce and halfway through, she decided she no longer wanted to divorce. After dropping three grand on the law, wow. I pushed for it anyway. You damn right. <laughs> you damn right. <laughs> hey. Comment number three says, a woman will disregard her family for happiness. A man will disregard happiness for his family. Facts. Oh, that's facts, man. That's facts. Is that facts? That is facts. That's definitely not a print. I can tell you that much. <laughs> damn. <laughs> Go that ahead, bro. Keep going. Kick it off, dog. Kick it off, dog. Again, mental health. We got to check on mental health in this country. Because <laughs> people be walling out and stuff just don't make sense. There's no way you, you I mean, divorce. you ask for a divorce. And then you say you don't want to get divorced. So that means that you was just mad at something. Right. And whatever that little situation was, you knew. And again, ladies, this is why men are not pressed to get married because of you know some emotional instability you can make a decision that again can change the outcome of his life right. forever and then yeah. think about this one commenter like he said i already lost three grand and you're gonna tell me you're gonna stop <laughs> oh hell no <laughs> i done spent my money no you this is what you wanted this is what you're gonna get so again instead of making rash decisions go in your room go get you a a a, a, a yangling a Jaeger bomb or whatever it is, your choice, weed, whatever you want, get what you want, ch take a chill pill, come back. Because you make that decision and now look at That's you. It. You want Al Gore's mm -hmm. internet crying. Right. And nobody cares. Yeah, go right. get the rose, rub one out. There you go. And then you think what, you know, when you post it, was it post not clarity? You can get the you rose. You talking about a flower rose or one of them, the rose yeah. toy? Mm -hmm. Use your imagination. You can get a rose, a sunflower, <laughs> whatever. Whatever <laughs> floats your boat. Look at hey, T. Go ahead, hey, T. Hey, what do hey, you got to say, T? Update on them roses. I did get one since that last time we did talk. Oh, for real? This is not quite up to what I thought it was going to be. But hey, it is what it is. Did you did, did you get the one with the, the <sighs> car battery hookup or? Look, it, it doesn't even matter. That, that's called the weed. <laughs> that's the big one. <laughs> All right. So when it comes to this woman right here, it sounds like she wanted him to chase her. And that's not. But they weren't already married. Yeah, yeah but that's what that, I'm saying. The chasing should be yeah, done. but see, the, if she's not in that mentality, it seems like she's in the real immature mentality. Because at the end of the day, if I'm married to somebody, there are going to be hard times. You're not yeah. going to sit here and tell me I'm done. I don't want to be bothered with you, and I'm gonna go ahead and file for a divorce. Once you file on papers, that's it. And that's why I'm because my thing is, is like, paid at, what three, point, at what point are you going to say, you know what, I feel some kind of way. And ain't nobody got time for that. Oh, God. Bro, what you got, bro? Listen, I threatened somebody with that shit before, so I ain't even going to sit here and bro. Sure. <laughs> 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 Listen, I have been there plenty of times where I'm like, you know what? I get it. <laughs> he probably not going to work this shit out. I'm going to go ahead and leave. I got to the door. I was like. You're like, and you was trying to hoping she called you back. The motherfucking door shut. She didn't want to say bye, bitch. She's like, bye. <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> <laughs> Get out of here. I'm, I'm be out. Look, it, it, it is no harder feeling to being in a room by your motherfucking self. I don't know if you ever done it before. Have you ever been somewhere and you got nobody left and you there and you've been with somebody all the time? 
that's a game changer. Yeah. And every yeah. problem that you probably had is probably not even a problem no more. Right. It just kind of it sits in and it sits in differently. And another thing is, and this is just my opinion, she probably got friends. And I don't know if you ever noticed. All in her ear. Friends are fucking horrible. Miserable. They will yeah. tell you to do everything right. that they won't do. I yeah. give the worst advice. But you was in their relationship. <laughs> with so my thing is, is, at the end of the day, <laughs> he said he gives the worst. <laughs> she the in a relationship with this for. man, <laughs> but now she's no longer in a relationship with this man. Yeah. If that was the case, if she was listening to her friends, where the fuck are her friends now? They she like, in the garage. You know yeah, in the garage. Ridiculous. Trying to tell you, girl, you didn't need them anyway. That's why. But uh, I, don't, I gotta I don't, go fry this chicken for Kenny. Nah. See, <laughs> that's why I don't. I don't go listen to them girlfriends. Nope. I'm gonna talk to my man. Sorry, I need to talk to him because he's the one that I gotta sleep with at night. Yeah. Exactly. Well, see, that girlfriend be like, oh, shit, leave that, leave that motherfucker. Yeah, yeah right. And then, and then, and then, and then you, you hear her man listen. in the background talking about no, get off the phone, no, try so I can drop it in your drawer. <laughs> she in that, she in that uh, garage swatting off mosquitoes at night, and she like, I wonder if Lauren. Uh, I'm, I'm seeing if I could. I was just wondering what. It's like, like, it's like, um, oh, it's hot in here. Yeah, Lauren ain't worrying about you swatting them some mosquitoes. She getting her back blown out, and you was listening to her three weeks ago. She probably, yo, she probably didn't know how to talk to him. Be honest with you, yo. I, I, people got it's a real hard thing to have an adult conversation with someone. There's people yeah. who can't have conversations with their kids. How can you and not can't have a have, conversation so you know with your husband? And listen, I'm a, but a lot of I don't get it. Like a lot communication of kids. comes before I'm, the marriage. So therefore, if you can't have a communication with him while you're married, what the hell were y'all doing listen, before you got married? I, this this might be a this might be a take that most people don't want to hear, but I'ma just say it. A lot of women don't like accountability. Yeah, and when too. you bring accountability to the table, they will dodge that thing. They like the matrix. <laughs> I mean, they just dodging it. So, like he said, so it's hard to yeah. tell a woman, especially to give them a critique. Because <clears throat> once you give them a critique, now that's it's a it's a it's a personal jab. Oh, you trying to belittle me? Oh, you trying? No, I'm trying to yeah. tell you that the way you showing up mm -hmm. is foul. Yeah, and if ain't nobody true. else gonna tell you that, I'm gonna tell you because I'm your husband. Right, and but here comes a, all you attacking me and all. Okay, whatever. Yeah, oh, you ain't gonna listen, so especially when it's somebody you love. I'm right. gonna be honest with you. Telling somebody yeah. you love something that can hurt them, you don't know how they're gonna take it. Yeah, sometimes you don't want to hurt them that bad. Yeah, by saying kinda... something they want to hear. Um, and that, and that, that's a, that's a, that's another game changer. That that'll break some shit up real quick. Yeah. Well, Somebody the other thing is, is like I say all the time, a lot of people are getting married for the wrong reasons. People are getting married for the title, not more so to develop and have that true partnership. Mm -hmm. and, people and, are not getting right married. Are you talking right about reasons. me and my forty-five second marriage? Oh, Look, damn. Hey. oh I thought he was taking shots. Shh. And Look, again, most shot. people your forty-five second marriage. Listen, <laughs> most people think that marriage is the. Is the you is the mountaintop? That's no, just where you that's begin. Just the beginning. Oh my that's god! That's the beginning. That's just you the think. Beginning. Oh, I got married. I made it. No, no now the real work mm, comes in. Right. You right. got to put the work in to keep it going for however long you know till death do you part. And that's where most people get it messed up. Yep. Yeah. I, I think you got to do something to understand something. Yeah. You get yep. what I'm saying? Because you can say you want to be married until you actually been married. Your second marriage might work out better because you understand what happened in that yeah, first. Yeah, you already know. You already know that. Yeah, ends like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, every, but maturity, every maturity comes yeah. in with it too. Yeah. 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 Maturity comes in with it. And giving up right. the hoes is hard. I'm, I'm right. that's that's giving true. up well, the hoes is hard. Right. So you just think, like, damn, I want to be a to one? <laughs> damn, I got to give up my hoes? Oh, my what God. What the hell? That's kind of part of the deal. Really? Such a hater. Such a hater. Oh, I'm sorry. You're talking about the <laughs> You can talk about yours, but I can't talk about mine. <laughs> oh, man. Make sure you drop a like, drop a comment, oh y'all. Yes, Tell us what you think. Yes, like, sir. Let me ask you a question real quick. If, you, if your girl shot that video, what's your reaction to that? You know my reaction? Am I, that she crying in the car? Am I, am I like, yeah, yeah, I'm glad I left that bitch. Really? Yeah, yeah because ain't no, home. Like, it ain't no sympathy now. now. Ain't no sympathy I'm now because you should have you should have talked talk. to me before you did that. Yeah, I'm on my way to Onyx. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, uh, she yeah. mad? She about to be mad at this next post. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but that's your he, he, he hocking his ring and everything. Yeah. <laughs> oh, the video number three. So video number three. <laughs> my man, my man, my man, my homeboy. He says that if he can't pay her bills, 
she can talk to as many men as she chooses to. Mm. Kind of dumbass. <laughs> Simping at its finest. At its finest. Let's go. Where peanut at, y'all? Where peanut? At? Where peanut? Yeah. It's this jump podcast. Oh. Let's go. I don't care how long you've been with her. If she still has to depend on other people to make sure her bills are paid, she's not your woman, and she still deserves to talk to as many men as she chooses to until she can find the right provider. I don't care if you have children with her. I don't. Be- I don't care if you believe you're married to her. If you cannot take care of this woman financially, mentally, and spiritually. She is still single and should entertain each and every man that approaches her until she finds her knight in shiny armor. If you don't like what I'm saying, become a provider. If you don't like what I'm saying, become a man that elevates her. If you don't like what I'm saying, become a man that can guide and lead her. If you're upset what I'm saying, you're the problem and you don't deserve a woman. You just deserve a job application. You deserve therapy. You deserve someone to talk to about your emotions. Women, if they're not providing for you on all levels, leave them and find a man that can because there are men that wake up waiting and plotting on women that they can love and provide for. Don't let these dusty bums tell you anything different. You deserve the best. I don't care if you have children or not. Sweet oh, little dusty bones. Oh, wait, 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 comments, please. Wait, 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 wait. Before, before we go to the comment, I just want to say, as a professional number two, because I am a professional number boyfriend two. Boyfriend number as, two. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And listen, boyfriend you know, I don't, number three, four, then, five. Then, 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 num, number twos don't want to be number ones because number one's got all the problems. Exactly. You know what I mean? As exactly. a number two, all we want is the skins and if you, and then for you to go home to your number one. I'm catching all the touchdowns. Yeah, exactly. exactly. You know what I mean? I'm coming off the bench. I'm scoring. And, I'm and then you're going my ass back down. <laughs> so look, the first guy. First guy. Look at T. What? Okay. <laughs> so the first comment. First comment says, many men would lose their minds if we stood on our ground on this. And you tell that was probably from a woman. That right definitely there. was from a definitely woman. Definitely from a woman. Definitely. I hope it ain't another man talking about many men. <laughs> many men. Lose <laughs> <laughs> their mind. <laughs> so comment number two. This dude is a simp in its finest. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> Let's give a to that. Let's give it a comment on number two, God damn it. <laughs> So, last comment. One of the most profitable things in 2024 is telling women what they want to hear. Not even 2024. Damn, Damn that's how you make money. What was that's man, a, become a, like a, a, a dating guru. What, what was hear. my man name? I, I want the truth. Don't just don't just feed me no 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 fairy tales. I want the fairy we can't tale feed you no fairy tale. No. What was the, I want, what was I want the, the truth? What was that boy named Derek Jackson? Oh yeah, he oh was yeah, cooking the internet. He was cooking, yes, he was. cheating on his wife, and cooking the whole yes, internet. He was. Yeah, yeah. So who, who we got in the house? Mike Martin, fifty nine oh nine, man. Welcome to the fucking party, Mike. Shout out to Mike. Yeah, man. Big shout out to motherfucking Mike Martin right there. Yeah, man. Yeah, got a drink for your home boy from this Ripple Reserve. Right. Oh, I'll be recovering and you gonna talk about you got a drink for me. <laughs> <laughs> Probably an AA right now. Yeah, 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 yeah. Send him right back. Yeah, yeah. You My fault, Mike. It's, Sorry, it's water Mike. in it. Yeah, yeah. So Mike says, forever simping, never pimping. That's how it is. <laughs> All the simps came far and what's it? Far, far and wide. wide. That's a, man, motherfucker, okay. Mike. Well, Mike. Come on, Michael. Mike must be like a, a old. He must be old. Got a snap to that. He must be old school snaps like that. Yeah, <laughs> hit, hit him with the snaps. Yeah, yeah Mike. Snap. Mike. <laughs> he want all the smoke. I get. Why yeah. does she? Why would she just be with other men? It yeah. don't make sense. What, what isn't? Well, see, a lot of the older women, especially women from my generation, they never taught <clears throat> the young, the modern women on how to be women. Same way, some of our men don't know how to be men. Like women don't know how to be women. I mean, I guess it depends on the background, too, because, you know, you got some women that did like, I mean, yeah. I, I did have some positive examples. I don't I don't act like these chicks. out. Girl, here. we keep telling you every episode. You are not. <laughs> you are in the minority. We talking about. So Kilolo and them, I know, you know, I know, you know, is that the one with the child named Tavion? <laughs> Marquavion. Mar- they they brothers, but they got different dads. So <laughs> you we know you know a couple key lolos. We're not mm-hmm. talking about you. We talking about the key lolos that's out there. You know, saying and period and all that going to period, the going sis. to the hookah bars at Wednesday nights <laughs> and all that. Talking about them. 
That's yeah. that's who this is geared towards. Yeah. Oh gosh. Yeah. Plog, what you gotta say, bro? Uh, so look, I'm, I'm I'm gonna say this. I'm gonna make this as clear as possible. Everybody out there in the world, please listen to this man. If what? y'all want to be some hoes, please. <laughs> hey, I promote the hey. Yeah. If y'all can't settle down and y'all need to spread your ass, <laughs> please do. Okay. You know I mean? Let's um. Let's keep it going. I want to see more women cheating on me. Oh, <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Let me just say something too. You didn't. said you want to see more women. See, yeah. this is the thing. I didn't look at it. I mean, but wait a minute. Yeah, think about it. That's a good think about it. He said that a woman t- should yeah. I choose as many men as she chooses. But he chooses, said cheating. So pleases. let me just say this. When, it comes, to woman, when it comes to a woman cheating, honestly, from experience, we are a little, we are a little bit better than y'all. Oh, yeah. Because y'all sneaky. <laughs> I'm not rocking with that. It all depends on what you call cheating. I oh only call gosh. cheating when you cheating somebody. If I start talking to another chick and I take her to the movies, and I don't take you to the movies. I'm cheating you out of something. So well, this is cheating my thing. different for me, right? So cheating to me is is if I'm in a relationship and we're exclusive. However, in this scenario, if we're not in a relationship. Yeah, technically I can do what I want just like you can do what you want. So well, I thought you wasn't a, married, yeah. technical. Te- yeah, but see, yeah, I'm not a man, and so I guess I don't agree with him. So I guess that means I need therapy, you know, and, and yeah. everything else that he said because I don't agree, and I'm a female. I, might need I don't. Therapy. I don't feel like. A man should have to every so if I'm talking to ten men, why should they all have to financially provide Damn. me? If those hey, ten men that, is talking that to so get that elasticity back. <laughs> you could probably quit your vinegar. day job. <laughs> get a little vinegar and hot water. You could probably quit your day job and be talking to ten men at once. Yes. <laughs> Let's do a number. Uh, that's a, that's a that's busy a night. Oh, that coochie smell like burnt tires, would it? Gosh. <laughs> what else y'all smoking? <laughs> Raw plastic and Ben Gay. <laughs> Damn! You got one of them, uh, what's them, F1 series cars? No, it's actually not. Every, every, every time you walk, every time there. you walk by, hmm, 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 a woman dating 10 minutes at one time. Like, Boy, she can't even walk by a fan without that motherfucker. Oh, God. <laughs> They're like, what's the one throwing in the bottle out here? <laughs> they like, they talking to her like, oh, yo, 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 bro, you know her? They're like, yeah. What's her name? Her name, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? Oh my God! Oh, what do you guys think, bro? Y'all throwing shots, so it's Listen. okay. No, we don't throw shots at you. Hold up. Hold, up. Hold, up. hold up, so it's okay for y'all to do it because y'all be talking like twenty women at the same time. Hey, but listen. the minute I'm talking to ten men is a problem. Listen, the old <laughs> adage goes: they say that the key that can unlock many locks is a master key. <laughs> But the lock that can be unlocked with any key is useless. I get that. I, just, so I, just, I, I was just throwing this in the area. God damn. I just boat cut. I ain't got time for this. <laughs> this motherfucker. Oh, let's go. Let's get I was busy. just throwing this scenario out there. Like, I mean, I don't, I don't do that type of stuff. And even if I did, this is the thing. At that time, when I mm-hmm. did used to talk to multiple women, men, it was never... But, Hold up, I was never sexual with any of them. You know, I'm, uh, that's what I'm about to ask you. So, so, that's key. So now, did you have, like, the man, you know what so I mean? Like, the man you'd be affectionate with. Right. The man that, uh, um, if you, if, that, if that was, would buy you dinner. It was, always, it was, it was you always one person. I, I, I've i yeah. never been the type that But the rest of the men you were just using for I wasn't certain using nobody. It would just be like, okay, just getting to know you, you know, text or, you know, whatever. whatever so, the so if one of the men said, come on, let me take you out to dinner. You yeah. using, you're using them. Not necessarily because if we go and have Ain't you eat? Yeah, we went That's have, not using nobody. I'm not getting affected because, and not getting no buns. I'm oh, sorry. But see, look, hey. Hold on. Yeah. You went half on dinner? I, I pay for dinner, yes. You pay for dinner? Yes, I do. Come Get on. the hell out of here. We know this is minority Maisha over here. Yeah, so we yeah, can't yeah, use yeah, her. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I can't yeah. use her. Oh, no, she, she might be tricking the men now. <laughs> 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 yeah. I'm going to have a game messed up. Yeah. <laughs> she only she talking about, shit, I'll buy you dinner. What's, what's going on? What, what, what am I going to get? <laughs> what am I going to get? Hey, hey, yo. My man, come here. Do me a favor. Give him some extra cheese. 
<laughs> and you wonder why you wake oh up in the geez. you wonder why you wake up in the morning getting your car and the, and the engine is hot. <laughs> Somebody just put this back. <laughs> or you wake up all the makeup white dogs like got gotcha, your ass good. Got gotcha, you good. <laughs> Damn. What's going on, man? <laughs> yeah, it was that extra cheese you right. had last night. <laughs> you wake up these women keep it. You try to fall in his coat. You think he get me? Like this. I, don't, I don't know, bro. I gotta say, I be street. Okay. Oh man, this your podcast. This your podcast. Make sure you drop a like, drop a comment, y'all. Like comment. Tell us what you think on video number four. Yes, sir. No, but no. Four. Video that was number, number three. That was number three. You know I be getting the numbers fucked up. <laughs> you know I be drinking. You know I be drinking on the job. He can't count. He can't count. <laughs> he just can't count. He don't know his numbers, y'all. We gotta teach him those numbers. So I had to teach him about responsibilities. So wait, now I wait. Teach he don't know numbers. his numbers. It's just a shame. Just Hold a up. Shame. What number we on? We on video number? No, Four. not you. What number we on? CJ, you know what number I, we on. I don't. <laughs> you know. What I, number we on, CJ? I, hey, I lived in Spain for a while. I, 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 you what didn't say got, it. What they got to do with So it? I speak a little bit of a different language. So oh, can you real? tell me in my language? Oh, okay. You know, we trying to do the Spanish thing. So why don't you say it, uh, Los? I didn't ask you. What number? What, what CJ. Number? Uh, I got it. Okay. I got it. Because you know I know Spanish. Go ahead. What is it? What number we on? We on we on, we on number number culo. Number Casamigo. <laughs> <laughs> That's what number we on, goddammit. <laughs> Casamigo. <laughs> yeah. 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 Hey, don't play me. Hold up, you know Spanish? They ain't no Spanish. Suavemente, Ben Sime, to quiero no rico los labios, Ben Santonio, suave. Oh, shit! Yeah! What are you talking about? I got it! 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 I got don't worry That's about my it. business. <laughs> you don't know what he said. That's my you business. You don't know what he said. I mean, it's not like you're going to understand. Right. <laughs> I asked you to say it in English. What did you just say if you know? It don't translate well in English. Because you ain't Spanish. say nothing. You know? He ain't say nothing. Yeah. What he said was, he please give nothing. me extra lettuce and cheese on my motherfucking <laughs> <Right>. tacos. <Yeah. laughs> Let me get two twat waffles. All right. So somebody in the comments that knows Spanish, what the hell did he just say if he said anything? Don't worry about it. He ain't saying yeah. anything. Yeah. They, they probably moving their hips in the comments. They probably <laughs> typing in there. <laughs> oh, man. So we got video number four, y'all. So video number four, which is story time. Yes. They ain't grand. Let me. Let me adjust my mic real quick. Oh, I like that's a little suspect. Got a little suspect right there. Hold up. Don't that put was your a face little aggressive. <laughs> don't put your face in there oh, next time you do that. That's a little, that's a little Look, suspect. Man, I, I thought that was my type of motion, not okay. yours. Okay, this joint after dark. I mean, that's my type of motion. I yeah. want this joint by me no more. Like, yeah. <laughs> I didn't want oh, this. what are you doing? Yeah. This draw after dark Listen, Patreon. Man, if some goddamn soon. motor oil drop out of there, boy. <laughs> <laughs> some gear oil. Some gear oil <laughs> fall out that mic. We know what it is. So we got video number four. So he want to know if he's the a-hole for checking out of his relationship after his wife said this. Peanut. Let's go. It's this drum podcast. Oh, let's go. I don't care how long you've been with her. See, she technical T, man, T, 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 Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my God. I was, I was ready to listen to him again. <laughs> what did they tell you? What? <laughs> spread it around. You <laughs> spread it. You know what? <laughs> hey, is it? Hey, my fault, y'all, because it's all T, fault. It you is know not. I mean? she didn't it have, is not. She didn't have it, it set up, not. so. He's the one over there with the controls, not You me. know what I mean? I'm going I'm, I'm to get on her about it. Whatever. Don't worry about it. Let me tell you something. Man, one thing, one thing, one thing, one thing that's always about me is I'm always prepared, okay? Always. This come from the same woman that burned the treads off that goddamn vibrator. <laughs> <laughs> it, went, it went from a rose to a weed. Get y'all back in the return center. What the? What is she doing? Hey, I like it rose. Oh my lord! <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Am I the asshole for checking out of my relationship after my wife said she wished I had a bigger dick, but we don't always get what we want? My wife, 34 female, and I, 34 male, have been married for eight years, and we have a five-year-old son. 
Over the past few months, my wife and I have occasionally been having arguments on finances. The main argument we've been having is that I want to take our family out on a vacation to a different state, but my wife wants to save up so we can travel abroad next year. Last month, my wife and I were having an argument again about this, and I was telling her a vacation would be really good for our family and our son. We talked back and forth, and I could sense my wife was getting exasperated, but I stood my ground. I told her we could take a vacation now, and we could also go abroad next year. And my wife just lost her cool and said that the finances made that impractical and that she also wished I had a bigger dick, but in life, we don't always get what we want. That stung me. I am aware I have an average size dick, but I've never had any complaints from anyone on it until now. And to hear it from my wife, it just numbed me. It then checked out of the conversation and my wife instantly apologized after she said that. I told her it was okay, and then I went to sleep. From the next day on, however, I distanced myself from my wife and just focused on work and my son. My wife tried to initiate a conversation and apologize multiple times, but I usually just ignored her or told her to let it go. I also started eating out as I did not want to eat my wife's dinner. My wife initiated sex one night, and I told her to get off me. My birthday was a few days ago, and I ignored my wife when she'd wished me a happy birthday and when she tried to kiss me. We didn't do anything for my birthday, and when my wife gave me a gift, which was packaged with also a handwritten letter, I told her to return it. I have no idea what was the gift or what was written in the letter, and I really don't care. I am at my limit now, and I know this is not healthy or sustainable. So I have seriously started considering divorce, but I also wanted to get an opinion from the people I trusted most in the world, my two siblings. My brother thinks I should at least consider marriage counseling first before proceeding with divorce, as he doesn't think this is worth jumping straight to divorce for. My sister has the opposite opinion, and she thinks I'm still young and fit, and I have a long life ahead of me, and it should be very easy for me to get someone who's much more beautiful than my wife, both on the exterior and the interior. Am I the asshole for checking out of my relationship and considering divorce? No, you're not the asshole. And let me say this. I got the perfect remedy. I'm going to say this. Mm -hmm. You know that saying that if it don't apply, let it fly? Yeah. So, I mean, he must really got a small (laughs) peewee. But who to really give me? Me? I be like this, bitch. My dick ain't small. You got that big ass coochie like throwing a hot dog down the hallway. From me, yeah. no. no walls. Yeah, no yeah. walls. Oh, wow. <laughs> like this. Isn't it? He must have. Somebody must have said something to him previously for him to think that. Yeah. Because he probably heard. First it of all, we know that y'all men, when it comes to y'all penises, that you know somebody attacking it, that's attacking your masculinity. However, for him to take it that deep, it obviously wasn't the first time he heard it. I don't think he it. took it deep. That you don't is. Think so? For oh, you to oh own- my bad. Y'all talking about what he's... Oh, I thought you were mad. Yeah. Oh, oh. Oh, 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 Lord. <laughs> damn. He obviously took it deep enough for them to have a five-year-old child. No, you could get pregnant with a one-inch. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> Lord. All spread. you got to do is hit the egg. <laughs> you know what? Number one, he maybe he should check and see if that's his child then. Hey, get get the paternity test. Yeah. I got the perfect remedy yeah. for you, Declan. Hit the comments first, but I got the perfect all remedy right. for you, all Declan. All right, but let's hit the comment. Let's hit the comment. So the first, so the first comment says, try to back doors then all of a sudden it's too big oh there you go <laughs> there you I go about about that. there you go I don't know you shit on your shit back door. No. <laughs> because if if his, if his if his penis is that small, back door ain't gonna work. Cause that mean it's not even long enough for it to even reach. Okay, then y'all you just shit. You know what? Uh, first of all, why you always 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 why you it why you it why you always 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 so it's like, oh, what, what, what might say? What might say? Just okay, scratching the surface. The <laughs> <laughs> so, wait, so, second comment. <clears throat> he is never going to recover from that statement. Their marriage is done. Yeah, Benito, like. over. Yeah. That's what it sounds like. I, I, yeah, it, it's done. Yeah. Because obviously, because he ain't like, 
he ain't doing nothing with her. He, you know, uh, you know, fuck you, bitch. So, third they comment. Them, they got them blue shoes. Hold up, hold up, hold up. I got, I got a solution. I don't for think it. it's the Bluetooth problem. No. It's, it's a, you know what? Here it is. Hold on, bro. You know what he need? What, what need? we talked about last week. He need to get on that pump. <laughs> he need to get on that pump. I got listen. Or, or he might need the big boy. Oh shit! <laughs> yeah. He might need that jaw right there. That's a temporary solution. <laughs> I, I got, I, Pump that joint up to thirty inches on it. Damn! <laughs> Hold up! Damn! <laughs> so, so, wait, so, wait, so, so, so the last comment said she is comparing him to her side man. Probably it's over, and that's why I'm, that's why I, my remedy is guess what? She's she's it's probably her side dude that's you know knocking the bottom out of her. You hit her with with the with the yeah you know I mean and then go get you your own yeah. little side joint. Yeah. Then be out of there. Go ahead, T. Mm -mm. What do you got? I know you got something to say. Look, I've tried that little honey pack. They don't do nothing for okay. me. You're a you woman. Know. It's not supposed to do nothing for you. <laughs> no, wait a minute, wait a minute. No, so, they got they got some for women. They ain't that no, they for men. What do you say? Perks is a bonus in a relationship. Yeah, see? <laughs> Shout out, Mike. So see? wait, so wait a minute. So wait a minute. I'm curious, because since you're the only female we got mm -hmm. tonight. Have you ever had a sexual relationship with 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 a man with a small penis? Not a relationship, but I've had encounter. Uh, yes. Oh did you, did, did, did you tell him like like? No, I didn't tell him. I just finished myself afterwards. Oh, Damn. oh, 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 oh. come on, Karan! <laughs> <laughs> oh my God! At, at this point, you might as well just told him. <laughs> yes. Well, I ain't do nothing with him again after that. Damn. Oh, come on. Damn. Yeah, you ain't, ain't telling. How he, he probably at home right now. Like, I think she's gonna call back. <laughs> <laughs> Let me wait for that call since 2008. Maybe, maybe my phone won't get a text message at 99. percent They ain't gotta be a phone. Hey, Jesus Christ! Oh, damn! You know, I tell you, women are terrible, man. Nah, but no, the thing that not y'all too. I just, Listen, got, I just got a high drive, so you know I it think, is what it is. I think that. What really set them off is that that comment had nothing to do with the conversation. Yeah, they were talking. So yeah, like yeah, when you get went, blind, yeah. if they was talking about sex and then it came up, oh, uh, he's talking he, about you, vacation. You're talking oh, about you vacation. You talk, <laughs> okay, you won't take me to Greece. You got a little dick. You're like, this is what? <laughs> I, I, I disagree. I it's think like it got. I think it got a lot to do with vacation because I'm. All right, I've been on vacation, right? You've been on vacation. Correct. You've been on vacation. Yeah. CJ, I know you've been on vacation. <laughs> What's the first thing y'all think about when y'all go to vacation? Oh, oh my God. Right. I'm tearing I'm tearing that, I'm tearing that <laughs> cootie I'm up. I'm tearing that ass up. Where I'm tearing that ass up. How long we tear this ass up? <laughs> but, we going to put these kids ass up. We can tear that ass up. <laughs> That's just what I say because it's different when you got the kids. When you're on vacation, well, you every <laughs> second you get, ain't nobody right. you like, ain't nobody right. Right. Real quick, real quick. right. So, she already like, you take me vacation? You got a little ass dick. Man, I can fucking go on vacation and shit. Oh, you know what, Pla? I think, I think, I think respect, you might be on or something. I think I'm on first thing you think about is where we fucking at. Yeah, I but where's the respect for the man? Where's it's the respect for the man? Well, you know what? Man. Nah, nah, you know what? You know what? I think Pla is on something because think about this. That's it. true, if, but where's the respect, said, though? If she said, that is the respect. you're taking me to vacation, somewhere I don't want to go, so at least take me somewhere I do want to go so I can enjoy myself. Because you're the only one who's enjoying yourself when you're going up and down on me. Hold on. With that it's little ass Johnson. It's called compromise. Now, now another thing. When Obviously. You, go on vacation, you look for action, don't you? When you go on vacation, you don't look for your regular house sex, do you? Oh, no. You go on vacation. I'm oh, putting yeah. it on the balcony, oh, smacking yeah. it right. up, and rub it down. Oh, my God. Yes. So, <laughs> oh, no. That shit probably pissed her off. You little dick nigga trying to take me on vacation. What are so, you doing? So hold up. So if that's the case, if she's always, if she's felt like this for a while, she should have been taking care of herself on the side. She never been on vacation. Hold up. So <laughs> they so, never made it there. So the, the, the average size house dick whack right now. Hold up. <laughs> average size house dick. <laughs> Listen, Plog, Plog is really on to something. Yeah, I mean, I he, think opened, he, is. he opened up my mind a little bit because now yeah. I'm thinking like, so this is why women be complaining that that we'll never go on vacation. Cause they really be looking for the vacation. Yeah, you try to get drunk by the Oh net. damn! Yeah, I'm, I'm enlightened tonight. Oh, yeah. 
Damn. I, I think I've been going on vacation and been like, I swear, they was like, we going to Disney World. In the back of my mind, like, I'm fucking in this fucking house. <laughs> I don't give a fuck how many people there. I don't care how many. I don't give a fuck who here. I don't, I don't give a fuck about I'm Minnie. Man. I don't give a fuck right. about Mickey. <laughs> <laughs> you ever been, at, first you ever been on vacation with people? Y'all do like Airbnb? I don't need to just go on vacation just to have. Everybody got a dumb look on their face when they see each other. Yeah. Facts. <laughs> <laughs> what y'all doing here? <laughs> I know y'all was coming. Everybody got a dumb look on their face and shit. Oh, shit. <laughs> Y'all yeah, airs last night, right? Yeah, what day? What, what day y'all flying out? Y'all, y'all flying right, out right. Thursday yeah, or Friday? Thursday, yeah, yeah. I need that. We friends. said we, we said one more day. Today, all right. Yeah, so all right. we got the kids on Tuesday. <laughs> y'all got the kids on Thursday. And y'all can do y'all stuff. We can, everybody drop up. Yeah. <laughs> Damn, I don't need to I'm in to, to have intercourse. I really don't. I, I, and I don't want to wait that long either. But it make it Damn, you guys. You fuck up somebody else. Are you on a plane yes. with it? Is that, is that what you're on? You on a plane with it? <laughs> Damn. <laughs> <laughs> they like, fasten your seat. Fasten, fasten your seat. God damn, can y'all put your seatbelt on? <laughs> they getting busy it's, in that. Excuse me, in Miss. Aisle seven. <laughs> <laughs> excuse me, Miss Honey Dipsy. This, this is your eighth flight in a row. Why do you always keep requesting the back row? Right. <laughs> <laughs> And wife, we going to fly miles, God damn it. it smells in here. It's like it's like coconut oil with aqua buggy. I don't, I don't know what it is. It's, it's hurting my nose. It's hurting my nose. <laughs> That's your podcast, y'all. Make sure you drop a like, drop a comment. Tell us what you think, God damn. Yes, sir. Now then, teeth. Boy, she terrible, boy. She I terrible. am not. not like teeth. you say, I'm every man's dream, right? Yeah. He no, said, white, yeah. white man's dream. dream. White man's dream. <laughs> I mean, no, no disrespect, but yeah, yeah, yeah. sorry, white man. Hey, oh, damn. hey, 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 I'm, I'm rolling them. Have, have you, have you ever them. been part of the Mile High Club? No, Mm-mm. I'm trying to get. Do, there. do you know what the Mile High Club is, T? What's the Mile High Club? <laughs> Did you in the Mile be High Club? What's up? Up in the air? Yeah, yeah. Big Flying. shout out to anybody who's part of the Mile High. You never in the yeah, Mile High shout Club? Shout out to the Mile High Club. My, let me get into the Mile High Club. Right there. I ain't get there yet. One day. Uh, Ma- I see what you're talking about. No, not yet. The, the Mile High Club is when you no, have sex in the about. bathroom on a plane. No, that's what I'm saying. No, I haven't. You haven't been sex in the Mile High Club? Mm-mm. Get out of here. Mm-mm. You know, we're going to get you that Mexican man so we can. <laughs> oh, shoot. We can get you. <laughs> we can probably be yeah. nervous as shit on the plane. Where we going? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what happened here. He, he think he might get deported. Come on. Oh, damn. Yeah. I'm not going in the back with Shout you. Shout out to my Mexican brothers. <laughs> <laughs> no. We love y'all. <laughs> we, love, we love all our Mexican brothers, goddamn. Mm-hmm. All right, so look, video. Tell you what video we on, T. Spanish, please. Spanish, please. What? Come on. Cinco. Damn. Well, about the Spanish people don't say it like that, though. (laughs) You sound like you was Afro Latino right there. Say say it then, CJ. Cinco. (laughs) (laughs) Like like she had attitude. (laughs) Cinco. (laughs) Cinco. All right. So, video number five. (laughs) So, ooh, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Let me sure I got it. I, I, oh, I got. I, like, I got. I, I got to make sure T got Mike, it. I like this Mike Martin. He said the Mile High Club is taking this motherfucking snake on this motherfucking plane. There we go. <laughs> Shout, out. Shout out, to Mike. Mike. Goddamn. Shout out to Mike. Goddamn. Shout out to Mike. Shout out to Samuel too. You know what, Mike? I might need to meet you. We might need to go on a plane together. Oh, Don't do it, okay, Mike. Oh, <laughs> Put your man. Instagram up there, Mike. You hey. might get a DM later, baby. Mike. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I man. No. Well, Mike might be like, shit, girl. You ain't saying shit to Canada. You just slick your can of oil. Make sure all your pictures are from the top, Mike. You know what I mean? Man, you like, shit. No, right, so. just don't be all about words. I'm about actions. Oh, Damn. Oh, my God. Well, this joint after dark. Patreon coming soon. <laughs> all the fans might be coming soon, too. We never know. <laughs> yeah, I mean, so. Video number five. Uh. Oh, T, I said, T, get it. T, what? T, Distraction. T. What? T always messes up. What did up, I do? Man. I don't know. I'm blaming on you anyway. Oh, Lord. So, so, video number five. <laughs> this woman expects for a man to pay for her pre and post date expenses. She must do crystal meth. Is that is <laughs> is that what the modern women are coming to? Goodness. Pre and post date expenses. Maybe she do crystal meth before she and after date. Yeah, Let's maybe. Find out. Let's find out. It's this jump podcast. Oh, let's go. Okay, so I just got into my car after going on a date, right? And let me just tell you something. I don't know what the deal is with like men now, but I had 
told him prior that I will be having pre and post date expenses and is that okay and are you going to cover them and I don't know if he wasn't listening or like what the deal was or whatever but he when I handed him the white envelope he looked shocked and then he opened it and it's receipts hello pre post date expenses hello like what kind of females do you be dating you know what I'm saying so anyway so I handed it to him and he literally looked shocked at me and said I can't cover this it was $478 for pre and post date expenses you asked me on a date and mind you we really didn't even have that good a conversation because he was on his phone the whole time and I have a very strict no phone policy on dates hello you're here to pay attention to me look at all the effort that I had to put into to going on this date and now you have a problem with pre and post date expenses are you f***ing kidding he is kidding you're <laughs> kidding she's a joke yeah first of all motherfucker need a refund on that shit she better be giving pre and post date fellatio yeah, yeah. Oh, hello uh, listen, she would have gave me a white envelope, but I'd have gave him her condom. <laughs> <laughs> what? I'm sure, I, what? I'm gonna pay for this. You gonna pay for that? <laughs> I didn't realize I was paying for pussy tonight. <laughs> why we? Why we even go to dinner? <laughs> what are we, doing? We, we just cut the chase. Right. Right. I could have gave you this forty dollars at seven o'clock. <laughs> yeah, what I mean, God damn. <laughs> no, look, so the oh, first, she said four hundred. I I could have gave you this forty dollars <laughs> at seven o'clock. We could have skipped all this and wasted. Instead of wasting all his time. <laughs> so, so the first comment, the first first comment says, "Girl, you need to get your money back from those expenses." That's what I'm talking about. Yeah, what because that makeup that job that she had, she looked okay. terrible. Yeah, but what else? Did, what, what else? Maybe she was, was going for that look. On? Yes. Huh? Yeah. So what else was four hundred dollars on? Crystal meth. <laughs> okay, <laughs> it's a little expensive. Like, I, don't I don't know. She probably got a full Brazilian. She probably got that shit snatched from the front to the back. Oh, oh, <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh, hold on, hold on. What, what, what my man Mike says? That hello. <laughs> we get her left where I found her. <laughs> I don't know, Mike. That hello would have me like. <laughs> Hello, hmm. hello. <laughs> hello. I'm like this. Hello. hello back at you. <laughs> so, what we got? So, second comment. Men are choosing the bear as well. You got damn right. God damn. We chose to choose the bear man. too. Yeah, man. This is getting out of hand. So, we choosing the bear. Yep. Boy, I feel. I, listen. Uh, the, yeah, this is ridiculous. These this modern is men girl and like these modern sh- women. Boy, I feel sorry for my, for my our young cats. I do. Ridiculous. Because, man, if you got to date women like that. Oh my God! Whoa. Masturbation should be at all time high. Uh-huh. <laughs> I bet at all time. High. <laughs> Listen, I heard, I heard coconut oil went up four hundred thirty two percent. I've been seeing dudes walking to the wall all the time. They blind this shit out. Here. Oh, so that's what y'all use the coconut oil for? Oh, okay, I got yeah, you, yeah, it's all natural. Yeah, okay. you gotta you gotta make sure, and and it has no viscosity breakdown. Mm, exactly. Learn something new every day. Yeah. See. You could have had it in you. You chose, chose otherwise. otherwise. <laughs> <laughs> then that could have been you. That's <laughs> <laughs> what so we got. Last comment. And they wonder why we're choosing to keep our peace and stay at home. Come on, Kings. There's nothing wrong with right that. Come on, Kings. That is right there. Yes, yes, yes. Come on, right Kings. That's so why we're choosing peace. We're choosing peace over choosing pee. <sighs> Ain't that I don't true? know. Some of these guys like them toxic chicks like that, though. Hey, they they get the, they but, get a, they get a rise off. But of that. you know what? I'm, I'm gonna tell you what it is. You know what? It is? It, it's a game. It's a game that men play. We play the same game that the women play. Yep. Yep. Yeah, but then don't complain when they come with this crap. Well, not no. It's a game. They. Oh, I'm gonna try to get him for his money. Oh, I'm gonna try to get him for her Gucci. Yeah. It, it's a game. That's all it is. You, you try to you try to come so, with the toxic so, shit. So, we so, we so come her, with the toxic shit. Having sex with her is worth four hundred dollars. Maybe it all, it all, if I win, <laughs> if I win, right, she got so that one. Right. If, I, if she if she get four hundred before I get the coochie, she TJ won. won. TJ, you if I get the coochie for me, well, yeah, I ain't yeah, giving that four hundred. Four hundred? You paying four hundred, CJ? Not directly. See, they said I'm giving her these four hundred strokes. <laughs> Not directly. So if like we go somewhere, you go somewhere, you eat nice. You probably going pay. You gonna probably gonna pay between two fifty and four. Mm-hmm. So I'm not paying it to her directly in her pocket, but. Okay. She just got treated to something, so I I didn't pay four and now yeah I'm going to the store. <laughs> yeah. So what kind I mean that's all it, it's a uh, game. I'm at the candy what shop. Kind like, of candy 50 you get? like Fifty said, take me to the candy shop. Yeah, I mean, it, you can lift it, it's, this lollipop. It's a game. That's all see, it true is. players play the game. I'm like, mm-hmm. oh, you trying to get money out of me? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. We gonna we gonna see if I get that coochie because mm-hmm. if I get that coochie, I pay for it. Yeah, just like all right. 
I my life you. is not a game. I ain't got time for just this, this crap. It's, it's, it's all, it's all, it's all. We already know what you're about. You're about the business. Like, just, just come to me straight. Like, <laughs> Whoa. <Yes. laughs> Whoa. That was a little spicy. Come hey. to me straight. Wait, in more than one way, too. Wow. Oh, my Lord. But then, it, you know, then again, one of them is not always as straight because it has like that little hook and that little curve. So, <laughs> okay. Are you, are you like a journal right about this shit? Yeah. Like, are, are you a urologist? <laughs> like, what is going on <laughs> She's a dickologist. What's the writing that my notebook is going yeah. on here? Yeah. <laughs> What classes did you take in school? <laughs> Don't you like, school? Uh, before we get started here, hold on. <laughs> Draw this picture. Mm. Okay. <laughs> Perfect. Yeah, it's a little. All right. Now, what were you saying, sir? <laughs> oh, man. That's your podcast, y'all. Your own podcast. You know what I'm Make sure you drop a like, drop a comment, y'all. Tell us what you think. Like, comment, subscribe. What are you talking about? I kind of like my milk and magnesia over here. I, I say, let her, listen, let her cook. Let her cook. That's what I'm saying. Ain't nothing wrong I mean, with it. Yeah, listen, hello? <laughs> I mean, I mean, she, she hands you the envelope and you pay it. It's your yeah. business. And, and listen, ain't nothing wrong with giving her you. She gives yeah. you an envelope, give her the condom. Yeah, but some, some dudes like to be treated like that, though. Some dudes. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Mm. They get off on that. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Me? No, because I can't afford that shit. Oh, well, I guess, <laughs> I guess you know, to, to, to build their ego, make them feel wanted and needed. Is that what that is? I, I don't know. I ain't nope. that much money. <laughs> <laughs> some of them just, they know the game and they understand it. So it's just, it's like, it's a part of it. I know a couple guys that's like, all right. Whatever it takes to get to the prize, I'm gonna get to yeah, the prize. I'm gonna get to the prize. So they just they cool with that. They understand that that's, that comes with the territory. Exactly. So, and exactly. it look like you know on this on this video, you know, her lips is lipping. So maybe they say, hey, yeah. I want to see if yeah. I can get the lips to be lipping. I'll, I'll pay whatever I need to pay. And then when his homies be like, what happened with you and the chick in the white envelope? Hello. What happened? Yeah, I mean. it's, it's, it's more than the lips it's the tongue too so she, her, her tongue better have that act, same activity okay, so yeah, she, 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 might, she might got that tongue game she might got that tongue game on rock boy. that shit look dry as shit bro <laughs> <laughs> I mean some, you on some people can't. might be into that dry rub you know what I'm saying <laughs> dry rub <laughs> dry rub <laughs> <ribs. Yo. laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm not judging you know what I mean but she turned around and looked at you like like that with that face while you back there. Hello. <laughs> Wait, I was like, hello, <laughs> hello. <laughs> you probably back there putting some of your finest work on. <laughs> you got your Tim's on, your fitted down <laughs> and shit. <laughs> hello. <laughs> yeah, I mean, make sure you drop a like, drop a comment, and subscribe. That's what I'm talking about. Yes, and to all of our new subscribers over the week. <laughs> My bitches. <laughs> <laughs>